An aircraft carrier's flight deck is a place where danger, precision, and teamwork intersect to achieve one of the most impressive feats in naval aviation. The U.S. Navy relies on these floating airfields to project power worldwide, and every launch and recovery is a carefully choreographed operation. The noise is deafening, the pace relentless, and the stakes sky high. Yet, day after day, sailors pull off this complex dance with skill, focus, and unwavering discipline. Let's dive into the organized chaos of flight deck operations and explore what makes this environment so extraordinary. From sunrise to sunset, and often through the pitch black of night, the flight deck remains in constant motion. The carrier's mission never stops, and neither do the men and women who make it possible. The deck is a whirlwind of activity, with jets being launched, recovered, refueled, and maintained in a never-ending cycle. The roar of jet engines, the smell of jet fuel, and the blast of afterburners create an environment where every sense is overwhelmed. Timing is everything, and any delay or error can disrupt the flow of operations. As each aircraft completes its mission and returns, another is prepped to launch. This continuous tempo demands extreme focus and coordination from everyone involved. Mistakes are not an option. The flight deck crew's ability to maintain this relentless pace showcases the Navy's commitment to operational excellence and readiness. There's no such thing as a quiet day on the flight deck. Every moment is filled with intensity and purpose. To maintain order amidst this chaos, every sailor on the flight deck has a specific role, easily identified by the color of their uniform. These colors are more than just clothing. They represent critical functions that keep operations running smoothly and safely. Yellow shirts. These are the aircraft directors and shooters. They control the movement of aircraft, guide them into position, and oversee the launch process. Shooters give the final signal to launch jets, working closely with pilots and catapult operators. Green shirts, responsible for operating the catapults and arresting gear systems. They ensure that aircraft are launched and recovered safely. Red shirts, these sailors handle ordnance, including loading bombs, missiles, and ammunition. They ensure all weapons are secured and ready for deployment. Purple shirts, known as grapes, they manage refueling operations, making sure each aircraft has the precise amount of fuel needed for its mission. Brown shirts serving as plane captains, they are responsible for the overall readiness of specific aircraft. They inspect and prepare the planes before each mission. Blue shirts, they assist in moving aircraft, securing them to the deck and handling essential support equipment. This color-coded system ensures that everyone knows their role at a glance. In an environment where a single mistake can be catastrophic, this organization is vital to maintaining safety and efficiency. Launching a jet from an aircraft carrier is a breathtaking display of power, engineering, and precision. The process begins when the aircraft is taxied into position by a yellow-shirted director, the pilot performs final pre-flight checks while deck crews secure the aircraft to the catapult system. The shooter, an officer in a yellow shirt, stands ready to give the final launch signal. After a last round of checks and confirmations, the shooter raises their arm and points forward. In an instant, the catapult propels the jet down the deck, accelerating it from zero to over 150 miles per hour in just a few seconds. The roar of the engines and the blur of motion as the jet soars into the sky are awe-inspiring, marking the beginning of another mission. Recovering aircraft on the flight deck of a U.S. Navy aircraft carrier is one of the most intense and high-stakes operations in naval aviation. These carriers, such as the Nimitz class and the newer Gerald R. Ford class, are designed to handle high-tempo flight operations, capable of launching and recovering dozens of aircraft per day. At peak efficiency, a carrier can launch and recover an aircraft every 60 to 90 seconds during sustained operations. Flight deck typically measuring around 1,092 feet, 
333 meters long and 252 feet, 77 meters wide, must accommodate a full complement of up to 75 to 90 aircraft. These can include EA-18 Super Hornets, EA-18G Growlers, E-2 Hawkeyes, and MH-60 Seahawk helicopters, among others. Coordinating the movement, launch, and recovery of these aircraft in such a confined space requires unparalleled precision and teamwork. When aircraft return to the carrier after completing their missions, they must land on a deck that is constantly moving with the motion of the sea. The pilot's objective is to catch one of the four arresting cables stretched across the deck with the aircraft's tail hook. These cables, part of the arresting gear system, are designed to bring a jet traveling at approximately 150 miles per hour, 241 kilometers per h, to a complete stop in just two seconds. A fully functioning carrier can perform up to 160 launch and recovery cycles per day during intense flight operations. This relentless pace of launching and recovering aircraft is necessary for maintaining air superiority, conducting surveillance, and supporting combat missions. Each cycle involves a coordinated effort from hundreds of sailors on the flight deck, ensuring that aircraft are cleared, refueled, and rearmed quickly to return to the fight. Night landings add another layer of complexity and danger to these operations. In low light conditions, pilots must rely on the faint glow of the deck's lights, the meatball, and the voice commands from the LSO. The carrier's deck lighting is kept to a minimum to avoid detection by potential adversaries, making these night traps among the most challenging maneuvers in aviation. Successfully landing a jet on a dark pitching deck is a true testament to a pilot's skill and nerves. Every successful recovery is a culmination of advanced technology, human skill, and disciplined teamwork. The ability to launch and recover aircraft continuously, regardless of weather or time of day, is what makes an aircraft carrier such a formidable asset. This relentless cycle of operations, launching, recovering, refueling, rearming, and maintaining, ensures that the U.S. Navy can project air power anywhere in the world at any time. Carrier aviation is a high-stakes, high-reward endeavor. Each landing and takeoff on the flight deck represents the incredible dedication, precision, and courage of the sailors and aviators who make it possible. This combination of technology, teamwork, and skill ensures that the U.S. Navy remains unmatched in its ability to operate at sea and dominate the skies. Safety is a top priority on the flight deck. One essential routine is the FOD walkdown, a systematic search for foreign object debris. Even a small bolt or piece of metal can be deadly if ingested by a jet engine. Before and after each launch or recovery cycle, sailors line up and walk shoulder to shoulder across the deck, scanning for debris. This simple yet critical task helps prevent accidents and keeps operations running smoothly. While jets handle combat missions, helicopters play a crucial support role. During vertical replenishment VERTREP missions, MH-60 Seahawk helicopters transport supplies, mail, and personnel between ships. These missions ensure that carriers remain stocked with food, fuel, and ammunition, allowing them to stay at sea for extended periods. The coordination required between helicopter crews and deck personnel is vital to maintaining the carrier's operational readiness. Between missions, aircraft need to be inspected, refueled, and rearmed. Maintenance crews check engines, hydraulics, and avionics to ensure everything is in working order. Refueling teams, known as grapes, top off the fuel tanks while ordnance crews load bombs and missiles. Plane captains oversee the entire process, ensuring each aircraft is ready for its next mission. This rapid turnaround keeps the carrier's strike capability at its peak. The flight deck of a U.S. Navy aircraft carrier is a place where chaos meets precision, where danger is part of the daily routine, and where teamwork is the key to success. 
every launch recovery and maintenance task is a testament to the skill, discipline, and dedication of the sailors who make it all happen. Would you dare to experience a day in the heart of the action, feeling the adrenaline of launches and landings up close? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this insight into the thrilling world of U.S. Navy flight deck operations, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more incredible naval stories.